Welcome to Spiritual Dessert Juice, episode 143. <laughs> First thing in the morning. I don't know why angels wake me up at 5.55 in the morning. Because <laughs> they love me. <laughs> and of course, I hear in my head, I love you. I have this adorable pillow. It's very soft and very sweet. I think it's my new favorite pillow because it's just so sweet. <laughs> can clutch it to my belly and feel better within seconds everybody should have this like soft and cushy pillow so i forgot all my makeup on from last night's show because i fell asleep suddenly uh, i think i don't know i have this thing where i fall asleep at three and wake up like three hours later or in the case of last night oh i'm still sleepy <laughs> five the angels like waking me up early there's usually some amazing thing i'm supposed to see uh they never fail me <laughs> so this morning's it's about all of the teachers and people that have surrounded very successful very famous people that they actually predicted that they would fail <laughs> You know, one of those mark my words, you'll never make it. <laughs> and somehow, yes, they never felt that. They always felt like my pillow. <laughs> that they were loved and that inside, you feel the love inside. And then you're a great success. That's it. Despite all the awful things and the awful opinions. Uh, so you just should have a very strong and resilient spirit. And that's really all you need. Sorry the point of view is so close. I don't have... Um, what was that guy's name? The microphone? <laughs> it like fell. <laughs> uh, it makes me laugh. Anyway, thanks. Here's the show. Kiss, kiss. <laughs> And, mm, good morning. <laughs> so, the early morning is usually time for ferociously writing. Ferociously writing because the angels said so. Some stream of consciousness come flooding through and the hands move. <laughs> and then I read it after and go, who wrote that? No. <laughs> no. Ah. Uh, My eyes are super red. They're almost red as the lipstick that's still on. And my beautiful I love you pillow. Mm -hmm. So it was like one degree. Actually, I saw it went up three degrees. <laughs> it was three degrees. <laughs> I have no idea why. Why? <laughs> but at least I'm not all the way up in the Northeast where they got 111 inches of snow. That's taller than me. <laughs> Much taller. <laughs> so that's the other thing. Like there's always something amazing to look forward to. If you don't have something that's amazing to look forward to, you can just take out a sheet of paper and think of all the things you're thankful for that you already do have. Or you could think of the things that you're looking forward to and make a looking forward to list. And when things aren't going well, you just take out your list and go, oh, there's so many good things I'm looking forward to. <laughs> there's tricks. So I call them happiness tricks. You can just twist it and it's suddenly it's amazing. There's no, no, like, no difference between when things are going terribly and you have a mental picture that it's going great. Or if it's going great and you have that same mental picture. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> it's all controlled inside of your mind. Your perception is life. Your perception is. See, that's the problem. Naysayers think that the negative viewpoint that has been presented to them and forced upon them, usually from a mind media 
control, a mass mind media control. Um, that is reality, but that's not reality. That's what someone else has tried to force upon your mind. And because you're unfortunately pliable or made more pliable from fluoride water, you unfortunately swallow that and think that that is your reality. But that's not. Reality is the thing that you shape, you choose. Quantum physics shows that perception is what creates. Perception is what actually dictates what electrons will do. So once you know you have that much power, <laughs> why not play with it and use it for good? <laughs> you don't need to be negative for anyone else either. You can, you can bless them. You don't have to be a negative troll. <laughs> oh my. We are all the divine in a costume. And right now I'm in a sleepy girl costume that just woke up. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs>